Hello YouTube, it's February 19th, so I'm being up to date on my videos again, and probably will be from now on because I got some Okay, now my camera's back. Like I was saying before, my camera was acting up. I am back, and I think I'm going to be consistent with my videos from now on because I don't know what's going to go down within the next couple weeks. But I am sick. I'm over it. I My depression has come back. I have never told y'all I do battle severe depression. That, that's been around long before my Crohn's disease. I've been battling depression since elementary school. But anyways, I am very depressed. I'm not happy. I'm miserable. Even though I put on a smile and a happy face on camera, I'm really miserable. And I think I'm going to drop out of college. I don't know. And the reason and the reason why I stay is because you know I am I get my subjects in I'm learning new stuff every day marketing is my life I've been doing marketing since 11 years old so this is actually a class that I'm going I plan on applying to in real life I'm an entrepreneur so it's not no knit net pederat class I actually love the classes I love the teachers. I love the environment. The students are wonderful. That's why I'm hesitant because I want to miss the students and the teachers more than anything. I mean, because I'm lo I'm just lonely and miserable and in this house. And this school is not helping things. A 21 post have been my year. I said I am going to get out and know the world and damn it ain't nothing going to stop me and I think school is going to have to be the first sacrifice for my happiness because I am not about to be stuck in no house all day every day I mean I can't I, I mean what kind of life is that to be in this house all day nothing to do but work book work then my aunt comes, and then she takes up nearly all the day. Then I'm struggling to get my stuff done by 12 o'clock because between 12 and 2, the website shuts down where you can't submit nothing. So, yeah, that's what's been going on. I, I can't do this. I can't. I think I'm going to drop out of college to pursue my goals. I mean, plenty of people have done it. I mean, look at Bill Gates. Look at Mark Zuckerberg. Now, that being said, I don't think I ever get to their level because I don't have no darn search engine in mind. I do, although I do have this idea for 3D technology. I don't know how I would go by doing it, but I might make that marketing pitch to Google or whatever. But that being said, I do see myself being a multi-millionaire, but oh, multi-billionaire, ooh, that's a stretch. But I do see myself getting that higher level someday, maybe $40, 50000000 million. Now, don't get the laughing and choking on your sodas and looking at me on this camera. Talking about his genie looking ass, you better just wish all day long that money ain't going to come. I know somebody's making a little genie comment about me with my darn hat. Yes, at, by the end of the day, I had to plop this on my head. Y'all haven't seen this baby in months, honey. Don't my darn thing look like it's going to got bigger? My darn thing got bigger. Okay, give me a few more months. And when my order comes in, it's going to really be up there like Erica Bondu, baby. But anyways, let's get back to the topic at hand. I try to make jokes to prevent myself from crying because I don't cry enough yesterday. I cried my last tears yesterday. Yes, I, I got all the tears out so I won't break down on camera. I am not about to be like Wendy Williams. Uh-uh, I'm sorry. Uh, it's a time and a place for that. And on YouTube, y'all don't got time to see me break down crying. Because I give the ugly cry. I don't give the cute cry. I, I, I look miserable. 
I oh my goodness. When I cry, give me a ooh. Mm mm mm. I just look ugly, ugly, ugly. I get the ugly cry. But anyways, yes. But back to the top of hand. I'm dropping out of college. I don't know. The only question is, is when? Is it going to be the next few weeks? Two weeks? The end of this week? Or the end of this semester? Now, yesterday I was set on the end of this semester, but the end of this semester is May. And I don't know if I can pull it out to May. Because I got a body transformation to do. From head to toe. I'm getting my hair done. I'm working on these curves. Ooh, and my waist is uh, snatched. It is shrinking to a size 28. Oh, it's always getting to, it's like a 28 and a half. I need to go on down to a 28. My waist is looking slim. My hips are out. I need to get me a bad outfit to show off my body. Oh, yes, I got a price croak. They told me $97. The place I plan on going is David's Spa in Cornelius, North Carolina, wherever the hell that is. I have never heard of Cornelius, North Carolina a day in my life, and I am a North Carolina um, native. I've been to Raleigh. I've been to Durham. I've been to Dunn. I've been to Charlotte. I've been, I haven't been to Winston-Salem, but my aunt is from Winston-Salem. My worst of ass aunt that's been coming up here with her tacky ass laptop knowing damn well they're going to break down. And then she's going to end up asking me to use my laptop. Now I'm cool with people using my darn internet. But then when you get to using my darn laptop, now that's a damn problem now. I got work stuck to do too. And the thing is she at Liberty University. And she got this darn Bible class. She asked me stuff about... Oh, what language was the Old Testament written in? How the hell I supposed to know? I've never done a touch. No, I ain't going to tell that lie. I touched the Bible a few times, and I better be glad that it didn't burn the hell out of me, honey. Thank goodness that I'm still here. Mm -hmm. But anyways, I have not read no darn Bible front to back. I haven't even read a darn scripture too tough out the Bible a day in my life. So why in the hell are you asking me Bible questions, honey? Get your darn wanna be Christian ass on that damn dope. Cause she's one of them Bible thumpers that just manipulates and use the Bible to their advantage. Like whenever she'll point out somebody else's fault and talk about, oh, that's not right, that's not holy. And then you doing something ten times worse. Child, have a goddamn seat with your damn SpongeBob SquarePants looking ass. Got my Mountain Dew. Then this, all this darn stress on the scene like it done sparked up my Crohn's disease because now I'm tired. I'm lightheaded. I haven't had no proper nutrition over two weeks, and I'm getting to the damn store today, god damn it. You know that, 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 uh uh, I'm getting to the store. So hopefully my mother gets here, and I'll be able to get to the store. And then I'm gonna probably have to throw a bitch fit if they don't have my darn boathouse smoothies. I don't know what's going on with Walmart, but it seems like they wanna replace the darn boathouse smoothie line. And now that's pissing me off because now I got to find a darn new store. The stuff that I go through. The stuff that I go through. Only Diva Wan goes through this kind of shit. Where I can't get my darn Boathouse Farms drinks. Because vegetable, buying vegetables and stuff, that's too costly. Too costly and I don't cook enough for all of that. That's why I want to get to Atlanta so bad. Surround myself with positive people. Because when you surround yourself with all these miserable dang gone bastards, they, they, they just bring your whole damn vibe down. And to my new subscribers, as y'all can tell right now, I'm from the South. And even though I can be a Southern Belle, I have a seller mouth. Yes, I, I am a seller baby.
So y'all just gonna have to get used to that. But like I said, 21 is my year. And I'm not letting nothing bring me down. So I might have to call school quits. I don't know what I'm going to do. And then I can't even find no darn part-time. I can't even find no part-time job. Because I need, I need some coins. For some clothes and miscellaneous items. My bills on point. I make enough money with my marketing to um provide my bills. So I ain't worried about my cable, my internet, my light bill, my mortgage, getting evicted, none of that. My bills stay up to date. That's one thing about me. I keep my bills up to date. But sadly I don't have nothing else hardly afterwards. Ugh. I wanna get glammed up this year. Just for me. At this point, damn a man. What is, I mean. Uh, and I got to talk to y'all about my relationship issues. But that's going to be after the too much information video. Which I would think I would do now. So that is it, y'all. That's what's been going on with me. I'm very depressed. I'm all over the place. I'm quitting school. I would love to know y'all thoughts. Because I need some advice. Because I'm on the verge of a meltdown. Because I'm tired. I'm tired. I can't do it. I know I'm making excuses, but I'm tired of being trapped in the house. Books. It's too much work. 12 hours worth of work. Stuck in the house Monday through Thursday. No, no, I can't do it. I can't. I love to know y'all advice on this issue. Please, please put it in the comment section. Please. I need as much advice as possible because I damn sure don't have nobody else to turn to. And I'll see y'all soon with more videos.